Make me earn it. <laughs> it's wonderful to be here. Um, uh, what Indira didn't tell you is that this lecture series used to be called The Last Lecture. If you had one last lecture to give before you died, what would it be? So what is today's talk about then? It's about my childhood dreams and how I've achieved them. I've been very fortunate that way. So what were my childhood dreams? Well, you know, I had a really good childhood. Uh, I was going back through the family archives, and what was really amazing was I couldn't find any pictures of me as a kid where I wasn't smiling, right? Aw, oh, thank you. Um, and, and there I actually have a picture of me dreaming. Uh, and I did a lot of that. So what were my childhood dreams? You may not agree with this list, but <laughs> I was there. Uh, <laughs> All right, let's talk about football. My dream was to play in the National Football League. And most of you don't know that I actually, no. Um, <laughs> no, I did not make it to the National Football League. But I probably got more from that dream and not accomplishing it than I got from any of the ones that I did accomplish. Um, I, I had a coach. There was one practice where he just rode me, all practice. Just, you're doing this wrong, you're doing this wrong, go back and do it again, you owe me, you're doing push-ups after practice. And when it was all over, one of the other assistant coaches came over and said, yeah, Coach Graham rode you pretty hard, didn't he? I said, yeah. He said, that's a good thing. He said, when you're screwing up and nobody's saying anything to you anymore, that means they gave up. Your critics are your ones telling you they still love you and care. All right, next one. I mean, my God, what a, what a role model for young people. <laughs> I mean, just this is everything you want to be. And what I, what I learned that carried me forward in leadership later is that, you know, he wasn't the smartest guy on the ship. I mean, Spock was pretty smart, and McCoy was the doctor, and Scotty was the engineer. And you sort of go, and what skill set did he have to get on this damn thing and run it? And, you know, clearly there's this skill set called leadership. And, you know, whether or not you like the series, there's no doubt that there was a lot to be learned about how to lead people by watching this guy in action. So, and he just had the coolest damn toys, <laughs> right? All right, winning stuffed animals. This may seem mundane to you, but when you're a little kid and you see the big buff guys walking around in the amusement park and they got all these big stuffed animals, right? And uh, this is my lovely wife. And uh, I have a lot of pictures of stuffed animals I've won. <laughs> That's my dad posing with one that I won. Uh, I've won a lot of these animals. <laughs> There's my dad. He did win that one to his credit. Um, <laughs> So today's talk was about my childhood dreams, enabling the dreams of others, and some lessons learned. But did you figure out the head fake? Talk's not for you. It's for my kids. Thank you all. Good night.